Hello. Welcome to our online practical class. Today we do mother sauces and today specifically we will do tomato sauce as part of the five mother sauces. I will start. Pour a bit of oil on a stewing pan. Not too much, otherwise it results into a, an oily sauce. Lightly fry your mirepoix. Fry without coloration. Add your finely chopped garlic for flavor. Fry lightly for about two minutes. Add your chopped fresh tomatoes. Fry lightly. Fry lightly for about two minutes, then add your tomato paste. This will give a good color. And also tomato paste acts as a thickening agent for this preparation. Make sure the tomato paste and the rest of the ingredients are mixed properly. Finally, add your dried oregano and your dried basil. These herbs have a good aroma and they go very well for tomato-based sauces and dishes. So mix that well. We will add our liquid, which is chicken stock, to our already cooking tomatoes and bring to the boil. After the mixture has come to the boil, simmer, keep on stirring so that your ingredients do not burn. Earlier on, I had prepared some tomato sauce and this is ready for straining. You can see the color. It has a nice deep red color, a good consistency. What I need to do is just to strain and I'm going to strain it on a clean pot I am going to use a chinois or a fine conical strainer for that. So this I am going to simmer. I will strain what I had initially prepared into a clean 
pot later on i am going to correct my seasoning and consistency after about 30 minutes so we have strained our sauce our tomato sauce and uh, it needs to be smooth coating the back of your spoon a good consistency and a good color and we are going to check for seasoning always taste whatever you're making some salt, ground white pepper, Make sure again you are tasting. You should be able to taste your dry herbs, oregano and basil on your sauce. These two herbs go very well for any tomato based dish on the other side remember our other tomato sauce is still cooking slowly on simmering Make sure your consistency is right for your sauce and the color is just right. Quality of a good sauce it needs to flow, needs to have a good color and a good taste. So I will serve my tomato sauce and we'll have a look at the color of my sauce. So, our tomato sauce is done. Color, deep red color with a good uh, consistency, with a good flavor and a good taste.